sliding doors is an example of a very important trend in screenwriting in the last 10 years especially, which is the effect of video games on screenwriting. <laughs> and I don't mean that negatively. I do not mean that negatively. Yes, it could be a, a negative effect, but it doesn't have to be. What video games do, among many other things, is they give the viewer a choice of where the story will go. They make the viewer a participant in the writing process while they're watching the story. And that's very powerful. Now, Sliding Doors is a perfect example. We get, and they, because it's a film and not a video game, we've got to keep the, all, the choice down to two. Right? What would happen if they get on the subway? What happens if they don't? And we have the ramifications that play out through all the characters. It's a cute idea, and I thought it was a cute film where this effect of video games on screenwriting is much bigger, much more profound, is something we've talked about quite a bit here, which is the importance of the story world. That is why story world has become so important in the last 10 years in screenwriting. I mentioned before that 15, 20 years ago, or even more, when The Godfather came out, it was the kiss of death in Hollywood for you to spend any length of time on story world at all. The idea was, get me to the desire line, right now. Well, we found out with, with video games that audiences love to explore a world. And so you get a Harry Potter, you get a Lord of the Rings in film. These stories that have tremendous, unique, and detailed story worlds. And it turned out the audience absolutely loves it. It's not all about the desire line. It's also about, give me a story world I can live in. And that's where things like utopias and dystopias also become so important. So it's... It's a big deal. It's this whole thing with video games and this crossover. This is, there's a lot of talk now about transmedia and that sort of thing. What that, that, that really is is these different mediums have different strengths as story forms. And sometimes you can borrow a strength from one and jump it over to another one. And even if you don't want to write a Harry Potter, even if fantasy isn't your form, Understanding the importance of the story world can be, it is a very big deal. 